Hello everyone, hope you're having a good day. Uh, bringing you a short message today from Joshua chapter 24, verse 15. It says this, And if it seem evil unto you to serve the Lord, choose you this day whom you will serve, whether the gods which your fathers served that were on the other side of the flood, or the gods of the Amorites in whose land you dwell. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Um, I've been thinking a lot in reading through uh, the early part of the Old Testament and trying to relate it to the day that we live in today. And it's always interesting to look for similarities and, and differences. And even though uh, literally thousands of years have passed, so much about humanity remains the same. And it's so striking in the Old Testament, what's continually illustrated, if you kind of read between the lines or it's even explicitly stated, how that one person's decisions or one nation's decisions never just affected them. It always affected other people and other countries. And this is a concept that throughout the Bible, it's illustrated, it's kind of conveyed to us that, look, when you do well, it doesn't just bless you, it blesses people around you. And the opposite is true as well. Uh, when people do evil, it affects people. Whether you're righteous and innocent, someone else's evil can have a very negative impact on your life. You're innocent, but it affects you anyways. Uh, and as sad as that is, the Bible shows us that your goodness, that you choose to follow the Lord and say, God, you show me what's good and I'm going to do that. It might seem like you're not having a big impact. You might not see it a change in anything around you, but I can promise you that whether you see it or not, God honors obedience and he honors us when we obey his word and we say, Lord, I'm not going to do what's right in my own eyes, but I'm going to look to scripture and I'm going to do it your way. And it might be that our goodness, uh, or the Lord's righteousness in us and through us blesses people who are not righteous. And the whole purpose is to show to them the goodness of God, that people will turn to him and realize, hey, there's a better life. There's a better way. And the choice is ours every day, as Joshua laid out uh, so, so well and so plainly. You know, we can serve the gods that our parents served uh, before they came to the Lord, perhaps, however you want to say it. We can serve the gods that used to hold us captive, or we can choose to serve the Lord. And I want to encourage you today, whether you feel like you're making a big difference or not, whether you see any positive results or not, every day, just get up and choose to do the best that you can. Say, I'm going to serve the Lord today. And God, even if it seems small to me, I pray that it blesses somebody else, that my actions would have a ripple effect and be a blessing not only to me and my family, but to someone else along the way. God bless you.